Here at Consumer Reports, we're gearing up for CES. These are five trends we expect to see in TVs this year. Ultra HD TVs become mainstream. Almost every brand will have Ultra HD TVs at CES this year, as it moves from something of a novelty into just being the premium sets in a TV lineup. We tested 35 Ultra HD TVs this year, and several were among the top sets in our ratings. Now the good news if you're looking for one is that prices are expected to fall and we'll see screens ranging anywhere from 40 to 85 inches. More 4K content. To get the most out of your Ultra HD TV set, you'll want to hit it with native 4K content and so far that's been limited from companies such as Netflix, Amazon, MGO, and DirecTV. But at CES we expect more content announcements, everything from Blu-ray announcing finally a spec for 4K Blu-ray discs and also for cable companies who are trying to find ways to deliver 4K content to their subscribers. OLED TVs will still be pricey. Now we think OLED is the future of TV, but we don't think that future is here yet. In fact, at CES, LG may be the only company that's pushing OLED technology. Now we were able to test LG's 55-inch OLED this year. It was one of the best TVs that we tested with really excellent black levels and contrast. The issue for OLED is that the demand for bigger screen sizes and for UHD resolutions is going to continue to drive the price up. You'll start hearing a lot about quantum dot technology. Now quantum dot technology uses tiny nanocrystals that are embedded in the layer of an LCD and what they can do is help them provide more saturated, richer, more vivid looking colors. Now we think that companies this year will position their quantum dot TVs as a way of getting OLED-like colors, but at a much lower price. You'll hear more about high dynamic range. This is an attempt by TV manufacturers to improve picture performance beyond pure detail by focusing on things like brightness and contrast, which is the difference between the brightest and darkest scenes in an image. Dolby is promoting its own Dolby Vision technology, but we expect other companies to be working on this as well.